Hello, I'm going to give you a quick review on how to delete pages from a YOLA site, how to add pages to a YOLA site, and I'm going to give you a real clear distinction on the difference between uh, setting up a link on your page and embedding HTML code onto your page. So the first thing I'm going to show you is just how to delete uh, certain pages. As you can see, I have a home page, rules page, pages for different divisions, uh, and this news page over here. This news page I don't want to have on my site anymore. So the first thing I want to do to get rid of it as I go to the site manager. I find my page is the news page. I just click on this little trash can. Yes, I want to delete it. And now that page is gone from my website. So that's the easiest way, really simple, how to get rid of any pages on your website. Right now I can just go back to my home. And I've decided I want to create, uh, instead of a news page, which wasn't very effective for us, I'm going to create a results page so that we can display all the results from our meets. So I'm going to click add page. Uh, I want it to be a web page, not a blog page, so I just call it results, and then I click OK. And you can choose if you don't want it to show in your little navigation menu at the top of the page or on the side of the page. You can uh, choose to keep that out of there, or you can password protect it. So once I click OK, it creates me a new page. Uh, to show you now the difference, that's that's how easy it is to create a new page, but to show you the difference uh, between linking to an outside web page and, and then embedding something directly onto your web page, I'm going to use this column divider and show you one thing on each side. If I want to link to a site that uh, is outside of my web page, this is all I have to do. I put in a text box and I type in where I want it to go to. Click here for Saturday's results. Now, all I need to do is highlight this, and then I'm going to go up here to this little insert link button. I click that. I don't want to link it to another page on my site. I want to link it to an external URL. So I click there. Now I, all I have to do is get the URL for the link that I want it to link to. So I want it to link to this entire spreadsheet. So I just go get link to share. I copy this. I save it. And now I go to Yola and I just put in that URL. And this can be any URL. It could be you could have it linked to your Facebook site. You could have it linked to uh, an educational website. You could have it linked to anything. Uh, but you just want it to link to an external site. So there it is. Now when someone goes and they click on it, they will take them to that site. You don't have to use the HTML embed code for anything on that. If you do want to embed something on your website, you will need to use the HTML code. So This is going to actually take something from another site and put it directly onto your site. It won't link it, it will just put it directly on your site. So let's say for instance I want to take these 100 meter results. Uh, and actually the results aren't even typed in there yet, but all I have to do is I click publish this web page and then I'm going to grab right here just the 100. So I'm going to grab, I want the HTML code to embed on my page. So I get that, and it gives me this embed code here. So I copy that. Now I go back to my YOLA, and I just paste in that. And then I'm done. And it will go ahead and plop that right in there. So now I can see the 100 meter results. And you can see there's a little bit of a edge here, so I'm going to push that over. And now I can see all the results from that track meet right there. So that's an uh, easy way to see the distinction between setting up a link to another site, which you just need to use a text box and then click on the link thing that comes up. So if I click in here, you can see that I just click that to make a link. Uh, or putting in HTML. HTML is putting something directly onto your site and putting in a link is just when you click on it, it will take you to that site. Uh, that is all. I hope that was helpful.